Hello and welcome to our webinar about the Futura Mini. My name is Michael Strasser and next to me is Helmut Raffetella from Swarco Futurit. And he will tell us more about the Futura Mini today. So, Mr. Raffetella, who is our target group of the Futura Mini? The target group of Futura Mini are the system integrators. Uh, yes, and uh, their customers are the cities. Okay. Uh, the cities who are interested in bicycle signals. Mm -hmm. What are the differences between the Futura Mini compared to the standard Mini signal? Uh, the old standard Mini signal, uh, uh, you see it uh, clear that it is the old one because it has a lot of screws, a lot of screws to open the door and so on. And with the new one, uh, you see we have a plain surface to the front. And uh, what is very important, we have shorter bracket arms. We have now a bracket arm made of polycarbonate uh, with 70 millimeters only, so that the uh, signal goes uh, much more to the pole uh, than with the other uh, mini signal head. To open this signal head, we have, as I told, uh, no screws anymore. And if you see it from the side, also there is no place where you see, ah, here you have to open it. So uh, people have to know how it opens. With a small screwdriver from behind, you can clip it. You have to clip it four times, but you see, if you know how, it goes easy. And then you can lift up the front. If you see in the inner part, uh, we have also a solution for this signal head to fix it uh, through uh, the rear wall uh, to the pole directly. Uh, and we have here fixation points for the screws and for the wiring. And now I will show you that it is a clip system. Uh, I can open also here the cover or the bottom cover. You see it's a completely snap system and you see also that no screw goes in the inner side of the, of the um, signal head case uh, so that it is protection class 2 uh, in electrical. To fix it again you see it's a snap solution. You you snap it, you hear the click, and also here, you have to take here a little bit, and then you can also clip it in. And so, it's fixed. Uh, if you have uh, hard problems with vandalism, it's also no problem. It's a click system, but you can, uh, here on these places, you can set special screws uh, so that it is very, very hard uh, protected against vandalism also. And now I come to the front. In the front, here I have an LED insert, an easy one without wiring. Uh, but this is a system with a ring. Uh, so you don't uh, have to use tools uh, to open it. Uh, you can take off the LED insert. Uh, here in in the front we sit a gasket and then we put the LED insert inside. We put this special ring in and press it in. And then turn it a little bit and press it. And so the LED insert is fixed. And uh, by this special system, if someone uh, hits on the, on, the, on the front uh, lens, uh, the ring fix the insert much more. Yeah, and uh, to the housing, you put it here and you can clip also the housing and it is done. You see from the side, we have a small visor, so uh, that if someone uh, pushes to the signal head, also he touch first the visor and not the glasses. And uh, also, if someone takes it and doesn't take care, put it on the floor, 
it is not uh, dangerous for the lens. Okay. For the front lens in the past, we had uh, black painted uh, symbols. Uh, this time is over because now we have the same system as for the uh, 200 and 300 millimeter signal heads. We have also here masks. This mask also has fixation points. You put it here in and then you fix uh, the condenser lens inside, clip it in and that's how you have fixed a symbol to the lens. Okay, so to sum it up, uh, what are the main benefits, the values of the Futura Mini for our customers and their customers? Uh, it is a new design, it is a click system. Uh, you see, we have a made a special shorter PC bracket arm uh, but what I told if you have problems with vandalism you also can use uh, the existing aluminium bracket arms also for this signal head uh, you can use it directly on the pole uh, fixed to, through the rear wall uh, so that you have a maximum distance from the pole to the to the first point of the signal head of 10 cm, very close, very close to the pole. Yeah, and also uh, with the bracket arms, uh, the pedestrian area is more free because the signal is more uh, on, the, on the side of the pole. Uh, the signal itself is rounded. You see, you, we, have no, uh, we have no hard uh, things where maybe some bicycle riders or, or children can hurt. Mm -hmm. I hope it's a really good solution. Mm -hmm. um, which variations are possible? Uh, variations? Uh, then I have one uh, main point also for uh, existing poles. If you have a three aspect or a four aspect uh, signal head Futura Mini, you have the same fixation points as for the old one. Mm -hmm. This is a, a main point. Uh, and you can get it in different colors, of course. In our, uh, uh, what is our range for the big Futura is also uh, possible for the small Futura Mini. That means in green, in a gray, gray uh, with a black front. Uh, yes, and so on. Uh, and uh, you can have it also up to five aspect cases okay. uh, with special fixations, uh, as I told you, against vandalism for a five aspect uh, signal head, we would uh, use some screws inside mm -hmm. so that you don't see it from outside. But yeah. Okay. Which standards fulfills the Futura Mini and are there any changes in the future regarding the standards? 400 mm signals, uh, there are some national standards, uh, but not a European standard up to now, because the European standard is only for 200 and 300 mm for signal heads like this, uh, not 400 mm, uh, but we try uh, with the mini signal also that we fulfill all mechanical uh, requirements from that standard. Um, vibration, dry heat, um, and uh, impact resistance and so on, uh, that we fulfill it completely also with a 100 millimeter. Uh, maybe in a next uh, version of the EN12368 um, that uh, the 100 millimeters will be included, but up to now not. Okay. So thank you, Mr. Raffetele, for the interview. It was very interesting. And if you have any further questions, so please uh, contact Mr. Raffetele uh, under his email address or contact me if you have any questions. But I would prefer Mr. Raffetele. And uh, see you next time. Thank you. Thank you.